Fellow citizens of Antigua and Barbuda, the Caribbean community, and Africa, I bring greetings and best wishes for a productive future as we commemorate Africa Caricom Day 2024. It was the late Marcus Messiah Gavi who once said, and I quote, If we as a people realize the greatness from which we came, we would be less likely to disrespect ourselves. Remarks from Prime Minister, the Honorable Gaston Brown, to mark Saturday's Africa Caricom Day and to remind residents of their special ancestry. On September 7, 2021, African and CARICOM leaders met with a common goal in mind, to strengthen ties between Africa and its descendants living in the CARICOM region. A number of diplomatic commonalities uh, laid out the framework for a program of future cooperation between Africa and CARICOM. And at that summit, they also declared September 7th as Africa CARICOM Day. This is essentially what we are celebrating at this point in time. Chairman of the Antigua and Barbuda Reparation Support Commission, Ambassador Dobreen Omard, explains this significant day will continue to help foster more appreciation for the Pan-African and CARICOM culture and history. In honor of this day, a flag-rising ceremony was held on Friday, September 6th, before observing Africa CARICOM Day on Saturday, 7th September, with special statements from African and CARICOM heads. Other events are scheduled throughout September. Ambassador Omar says the Reparations Commission is taking the celebrations into the schools as well in a Get to Know Africa program. What we do is that we ask the secondary schools through, of course, the Ministry of Education, and we have a wonderful collaboration from, from that ministry um, to identify an African country, um, to study, you know, its geography, what its politics is like, what is, what, what is the flag like, what's the culture like, what foods are they eating, how do they dress. For more information on other activities planned for this month, you can check the Antigua and Barbuda Reparation Support Commission's Facebook page. As well, stay tuned to all ABS platforms. Reporting for ABS News, this is Kim Emanuel Baird.